I don't think I can do this. Oh, yes, you can. I'm Aaron, by the way, and uh, you have nothing to worry about. I'm the best. You are? Yep, won't hurt a bit. Promise? <laughs> I promise. Here, squeeze on this. Oh, God. How long have you been doing this? Ten years. See, he knows what he's doing. It's just gonna be a little stick. Nothing to worry about. Okay, wait, wait. You're supposed to hold my hand. Here we go. It'll just come and go. You won't even know. Hello? Yeah. Well, what do you do? I'm here for Tate. Uh, yes, you can sign him out right there. Oh, and Dr. Donnelly wants to speak with you if you have a minute. Sure. He'll have to serve an in-school suspension, just one day. Well, he's never done anything like this before. I know, but it's zero tolerance. We have to follow the rules. Yeah, I understand, I understand. Are you sure he tripped him, though? He admitted it. Okay. How's he doing at home? Uh, fine, I guess. What do you mean, since the accident? Well, it's only been a year, right? It hasn't been a year yet. Yeah, so, you know, it's been tough. Of course. But, you know, I don't mean that as an excuse or anything. Well, I certainly think it helps to explain his behavior. He's such a good kid. Yeah. So what's going on with you? Nothing. They don't send you home for nothing. Can we just go home? All right. that nobody's ever solved before. And sometimes the solutions can seem a little crazy. Today we're going to talk about this bad boy. It's ion thruster. First, let's remind ourselves of our regular rocket. You take a gas, you heat it up. So when are you going to tell me what happened? Tate. Wait. What happened with Justin? He won't leave me alone, that's what. I hate him. Why, what does he do? He pushes me and slaps me on the head. But in class? In class, in the bathroom, during PE, all the time. And he calls me a pussy. I got sick of it, so I tripped him. And you think that's a smart thing to do? 
Why don't you say something? What am I supposed to say? What are you supposed to say? You need to tell a teacher, that's what. No, they would call me a snitch. What? Who cares if some punk calls you a snitch? Why don't you at least tell me? I'm telling you now. Tate, if he touches you again, I'm talking to the principal. No, I can take care of it. What, do you think he's just gonna let you get away with tripping him? It's too dangerous. You need to be careful in your condition. I know, Dad. Time to wrap it up. Oops, sorry, didn't mean to. Payback's a bitch, huh? Hello? Uh, Mr. Diaz? Yes? There's been an emergency with Tate. Which hospital? Well, did you tell him he's a hemophiliac? Hi, my son was just brought in. Uh, what's his name? Tate Diaz. He's an ICU. I see you. Oh, what Ooh. happened? I don't know. I haven't heard anything yet. This isn't good. I'm not worried about the hairline fracture to the outer nasal bone. The damage to the internal cartilage, while normally not a big concern, is a pretty big deal to a kid with hemophilia. Blood was collecting deep inside the tissue and behind his eyes, but we were able to relieve some of the pressure and stop the bleeding. It's a highly uncomfortable procedure, so we had to sedate him. And now? He's doing okay for the time being, but we'll need to keep an eye on him. There's a chance he could start hemorrhaging again. There's no doubt he's still in critical condition. How much blood did you give him? We transfused one unit. We have two more on standby. Jesus. You're sure you don't want me to stay? I'm sure. Go home. I can get you something to eat. I'm fine. I'll grab something here. Well, if you need anything, you call me, OK? All right. And call me when he wakes up. I don't even care what time it is. I mean it. And tell him I love him. And I love you too, little brother. <sighs> call me. Right. <sighs> well, I'm sorry. Didn't mean to disturb. Oh, you didn't. Please come in. May I be of service to you? Service? I'm Father Kane, the hospital chaplain. Oh, OK. Well, uh, not really sure what I'm doing here. I haven't been to church since I was a kid. <laughs> Do you have someone, a relative in the hospital? Uh, yeah, my son. How is he? Not good. I mean, he's fine, just worried about him. What's your son's name? Tate. How old is Tate? He's 12. Ah. Tell me more about him. OK, uh, he's a great kid. Smart, talented, you know. He used to be so happy. Used to be? Yeah, um, my wife, his mother, was in an accident. About a year ago. I'm sorry. How's he coping? He blames me. Why is that? Because it should have been me instead. You sound as if you agree with him. Well, I wish it was me. 
would have traded places with her in a second. Guilt is a hard thing to live with. Irrational or not. Are you sure he blames you? Or is the blame more self-imposed? Uh, I gotta go. Oh. Would you like for me to go up and see him? Why? Dear Jesus, our Lord and Savior, divine physician and healer of the sick, we turn to you in this time of illness. O oh, dearest comforter of the troubled, alleviate our worry and sorrow with your gentle love and grant us the grace and strength to accept this burden. We place our sick under your care and humbly ask that you restore your servant back to health again. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. Amen. Amen. Tate? Tate? Where's my son? Is he a patient? Yes, he's been moved. Name? Tate Diaz. I don't see him registered. Could it be under another name? What are you talking about? He was in room 319. No, nobody's been in room 319 since Sunday. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Sir, please lower your tone or I'll have to call security. What kind of a hospital is this? Where the fuck is my son? Jesus Christ! I need security on 4-3, please. Why don't you remember? I was in an ambulance. Yeah. Yeah, you lost a lot of blood. Uh. Where's your bandage? Oh, it was annoying. What? So I took it off. Tate, what are you doing? You can't do that. Why? It doesn't hurt. Stop, stop. Be careful. Can we go home now? What? Can we go home now? Tate, it's five in the morning. You need to rest. Dad, I'm not tired. Just lay down, please. I don't see why he can't go home. Just keep an eye on him. I'll need to see him again in 10 days. Wow, okay. Yeah. Thank you, doctor. Stay put. I'll get someone up here to get you discharged. Dad, aren't I going to be late for school? What? You're not going to school? I have a huge math test today. I have to. Tate, it's about to start. You're never going to make it in time anyway. Dad, math doesn't start till third block. It's okay if I'm late. You sure?
I'm ready. Hey, I'm about to have some breakfast. No, I'm not hungry. Can we just go? We gotta have something. That doesn't look good right now. You're welcome. I'm just sick to my stomach. I'll eat something at school. Where are your glasses? They're messed up. What do you mean? I'll be fine without them. Since when? 31! 32! What's he doing? He has made 30 free throws in a row. No, he didn't. He's lying. Think I can clock him from here? No. Yeah, I could. Bet you can't. What the? Guess he showed you. Shut up. That's mine. Oh, in that case. Don't mess with my stuff. Or you'll do what, you motherless piece of shit? Ow. Get out of here! Leave me alone. Got it? Pussy. Hey! Got it? How's it going, Mike? Mr. Tate. What's wrong? I'm not hungry. You serious? Did you eat lunch? Yes. Well, try it. For me. Hey, Tate, come on. I worked hard on this. How was school? Okay. Yeah? How'd you do on that test? Got a 97. Good job. That's great. I missed one I should have. What's wrong? What is it? Tate. Oh, man. Tate, are you all right, buddy? You okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah, let me see. You know, maybe I should take you back to the hospital. No, I'm just tired. Can I go to bed? Yeah, yeah. Go ahead.
right now. You're gonna take it easy today, right? Yeah. All right, be careful. Love you. Bye. Dude, what's wrong with you? Nothing. You're all red. It's quite a sunburn, Tate. I don't think it's a sunburn. And what is it? I don't know, it just happened. Just now? He was like normal in science. Why don't you go to the nurse? There you go, Johnny. Yeah. Did you get in? I did. There's no alarm. Are we on? Yeah. It's a definite go. Okay. Are you feeling dizzy, lightheaded? No. Any chest pain? No. Why? His pulse rate is 45. Is it normally that low? No. Why? Is there a problem? Just out of the normal range. Could be from the nasal surgery, maybe medication. I'm sure it's nothing to worry about. Okay. No allergies? No. I'm gonna give him a low-dose antihistamine. Not enough to affect his platelet function. Could be a reaction to the antibiotics you're taking. We sometimes see skin allergies to the sun with certain medications. Keep him out of the sun for a few days and bring him back if you see any signs of it reoccurring. All right. And uh, what about his pulse? When you check his thyroid to rule that out, it could be a number of things. Perhaps lingering effects from the sedatives. Drink lots of water, young man. Okay. All right. Just hang tight. The nurse will be back for a blood draw. We'll call you with the results. Right. Sounds good. Okay. You're better, buddy. Thank you, Doug. Time to go to sleep. What are you doing? Shh. Dad? Yeah. Why don't you call me Tater anymore? forever since I called you that. 
Why'd you stop? Well, you were embarrassed, remember? Oh, yeah. Yeah, got all old and mature on me. Why do you ask? Well, I was thinking about Mom and the trip we took to Lake Powell. Hmm. Good night, buddy. Love you, Dad. Love you, too. Tater. That's the kid's bedroom. Back. What the hell are you doing? I said get back! What's going on? What do you want? I'm not gonna ask you again, you son of a bitch! Don't shoot. What are you doing here? You really have no idea. Who are you? Just a guy trying to do a good thing. Tate, are you okay? Yeah. You're bleeding? Not for long. No, Tate, you keep pressure on that. Tate. That's why I'm here, Mr. Diaz. How do you know my name? Dad! Give me the gun. Damn. Slowly. All right, all right. Mike? Well, you know him? He works at my school. Knees. Right, what do you want from us? I said on your knees! Okay. Tell me, what were you doing to my son? The thing's not your son. Your boy's dead. Earl was what doing you a favor. What sick bastards are you? Huh? Oh, shit. What do we do now? We go. We'll leave you all alone. Call the truth. No, you. Come with me. Why? Mike, it's fine. Just for a minute. In the other room, I want to no, talk to you. he's gonna kill you. No, I won't. Dad, don't. Shut up, you fucking Mike, leech. Hey, down. he's just a kid, man. Oh, said, Mike. No! No! no. 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 Watch your back. What? It'll turn on you. You need to take Mike's head off, just in case, and do it soon. And the same with the boy. Cutting off the head is the only way. I do it before the change is done. Once the heart stops, there's no going back. I'm sorry. Tate? Please. Dad. Yeah. Look what I did. No. Listen, buddy, it's not your fault. You were protecting me. Am I a vampire? What? No, there's no such thing. Tay, what are you doing? Tay, what did you do? No. What'd you do? Dad, Dad, it doesn't hurt. Dad, what? I can't even feel it. Oh my God. I got some bad blood, didn't I? I don't know. 
Dad, make it stop. I don't want to be like this. It's okay. You gotta fix yeah, me. We're gonna figure something out. I'll fix promise? this. Yes, I promise. promise I promise you. Take. I promise. I'll fix this. Hello? Uh, hey, uh, it's me. What's wrong? Is it Tate? No, no, no. Um. Well, yeah. Uh. Well, is he okay? Yeah, he's fine. He's fine. I just need a, a place for him to stay for a while. I was just wondering if we could maybe uh, hang at your place. Yeah, of course. I'll stay home from work. Oh, no, no. You don't have to do that. Um... Are you going to tell me what's wrong? He's just not feeling very well, and I got to take care of a few things, just figure some stuff out, you know? Okay, you're scaring me. You sound weird. No, no, I'm, I'm fine. Look, I'll, I'll explain later. I just want to know if I can bring him over now. Yeah, of course. Yeah, okay. Cool, well, uh, we'll be there soon. Is that Aunt Karen? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Hey, you would never hurt her or anything, would you? No, of course not. No, of course not. I'm sorry. <laughs> Can I bring my game box? <laughs> yeah, of course, buddy. Go ahead, whatever you want. Hey, Tate, it's me. Karen? Hey, buddy, where are you? Tate, you here?
Take. Take you here. Take. What are you doing here? Why did you leave me around Karen's? What? I told you why. You left me all alone. Tate, we talked about it. How'd you get here? I walked. Come on, no you didn't. It's too far. Where's Karen? Where did you go? Well, I had to take care of a few things. Without me, you could have at least told me. Tate, I did tell you. What's wrong with you? Why are you acting like this? Don't ever do that again. Hey, you don't take that tone with me. You don't talk to your father that way. Do you hear me? Now, where's Karen? Is she here? She's dead. What? No. No, why? I killed her. Tate, what are you talking about? You told me you weren't gonna hurt her! I was thirsty and you weren't there. What was I supposed to do? What? I killed her and now I have to kill you. This is Earl. I need to see you. You said, once the heart stops, there's no going back. What does that mean? Can't reverse it. You mean, you mean when the change is done? That's right. How do you know all this? <sighs> but not in a long time. So how do we know he's still changing? Well, he hasn't caught full fire from the sun yet, has he? No, he hasn't, but you're saying that it can be reversed before that, before it's done. Look, forget I said that. I don't know that for sure. I've never seen it with my own eyes. It's just what I've been told. I know it's your kid and all, but you gotta think about saving your own ass now and everyone else. It's all those innocent people out there. Okay? If you want my help, just say the word. Yes, of course I want your help. I want you to help me save my son. Tell me how. Please, hey, listen! Hey, look. He's my flesh and blood. How is he infected? I don't know exactly. But there's no point in discussing it. If you don't know who infected him, forget it. It was a transfusion, okay? That much I know. Please, I'll, I'll find out where it came from. Time's running out, probably already has. Well, how much time do I have? I'd say three, four days tops, but that's from the time of infection. Okay, well, the transfusion was on Tuesday. That means there's still time. I, I, I gotta go. I'm gonna be in touch, but I'm gonna find him. County Regional Hospital. Yeah, my son had surgery there on Tuesday. Who do I talk to about some information off his records? What kind of information? I need ID numbers on some blood he was given. Morgan, 
prepared. Uh, listen, I need, I need a big favor. What kind of favor? I need you to look up a donor. Can I help you? Hi, are you Abigail Dasher? I am. Um, you donated blood at the Central Blood Bank? Sure did. Uh, okay. Are you with the blood bank? Is there a problem? Oh, no, no, no. Uh, my son actually got your blood, and well, I just wanted to thank you. Uh, hey, come in. Oh, well, thank you so much. <laughs> no, thank you. You don't know how much that means to me. <sighs> Can I get you some hot tea? Uh, uh, oh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Well, at least let me get you some water. Sure. <laughs> okay. Oh, please, sit down. Thanks. What was your name? Um, Miguel. Miguel, it's nice to meet you, Miguel. You know, I donate about four times a year. I just don't understand why everyone doesn't. We should all do our part, you know? So, how is your son doing? Well, that's the thing. Um, he's not doing so well. No? Is he in the hospital? No, he's home. Well, that's good, I hope. <sighs> Strange things have been happening to him, and I wanted you to tell me if you know anything about that. No. What strange things? And how would I know? You know, just... Just tell me. Admit it. I... Yeah, I know about you. I know. Mrs. Dasher, I know what you are. I don't I know. understand. What I don't understand, what I don't understand is why, Mrs. Dasher. I mean, what, what is it? Is it some kind of game? Is it some sick Russian roulette where, where an innocent boy wins? <sighs> I don't know what you want me to say. I, want you to just I say don't it. Just understand. Say it. I know. Go ahead. <laughs> Look, you're... You're... You're a vampire. What? I know. I'm going to have to ask you to leave. Can you just can you just give me an explanation? I want you out of my house. Please. Please. Don't hurt me. I want you to prove it. What? Cut yourself. Why? You know why. I, I can't. You do it or I'll do it for you. Where? I don't care, wherever I can see it. Do it! Okay! Okay! No, 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 let me see it. Let me see it. Do you want me to bleed to death? My husband's gonna be home any minute. Shut up. I'm so, so sorry. 
Dear Jesus, our Lord and Savior, divine physician and healer of the sick, in Jesus Christ's name we pray, amen. Do you mind if I have a moment alone with the tape? Why? For a one-on-one -on -one prayer. Do you mind if I have a moment alone with the tape? Excuse me? Have you seen the priest? We haven't seen anyone. Thank you. Hi, can I help you? Yes, uh, I need Father Kane. Is he a patient? Uh, the chaplain. Oh, they have several of those. Uh, let me check his schedule for you. Sure. Uh, looks like he's here just a couple nights a week. Uh, all right. Um, do you have a phone number? I'm sorry, I don't. Uh, it says here that we just have his church address. Would you like that? Yes. Kane? was a mistake on my part. Excuse me? A moment of sympathy and, dare I say, weakness. Now, what the hell is that supposed to mean? You didn't want to lose your son. He was dying. No. No, he wasn't. I saw it. Death was near. That doesn't make any sense. He was in the hospital, for Christ's sake. He was being monitored. His brain was bleeding. By the time they discovered it, it would have been too late. Why didn't you say something? Would you have believed me? I don't see it that way, and neither should you. How else should I see it? As a blessing. You have your son. He will be with you for a long, long time. He wasn't dying. He wasn't. That's a lie. You're full of shit. 
After he gets his first taste of blood, he will want it all the time. But he will learn to control the hunger. He can get by with a couple times a week, but he must feed enough to stay healthy. If he doesn't, he will die. There are plenty of ways to get it without violence. He will have questions. I'm here to help. It is my obligation. Yeah, I found them. Tell me what to do. God, what happened? It's getting better. Oh, man, buddy. Here, let me see your wrist. trust myself. Why? I'm thirsty. You gotta fix me. Promise? You gotta make it stop. Promise me. Yeah, take that promise. to confess? Mrs. O'Leary, I'm here to take your confession. Grammy? What happened? Oh, Lord Jesus Christ, who died for us on the cross.
Father Kane. Is there anything else I can do for you? No, thanks. I appreciate you being here. What does last rite mean? Well, that's a sacrament releasing you from all punishment in this life and the life to come. Does it mean Granny will go to heaven? Most certainly. Okay, let's go, sweetie. Thanks again. It's my pleasure. Code blue in room 239. This is O'Leary. She has a DNR. I'm about to start dinner. You still like mac and cheese? It's okay, I'm not hungry. You sure? Yeah. I'm gonna make some anyway, just in case. I have questions. So, uh, why a priest? <laughs> it's all I knew. I was a priest before, and so I remain. Huh. I don't know, it's a little, um... Ironic? Yeah. It works for my survival, and it's more common than you might think. Actually, uh, excuse me. I have to take this. <sighs> yeah. Is Tate with you? No, why? I've looked everywhere for him. I can't find him. Uh, I'm sure he's fine. Uh, I'll be there soon.
so um, the whole cross thing, I'm guessing that's not true. One of the misconceptions. I'm not sure where that one came from. Misconceptions? What others are there? Well, I don't sleep in a coffin. Uh, and flying? Well... And living forever? That's not a myth? Forever. How can anyone be sure? Well, how old are you? Not old. I was born in 1908. So, this means that Tate's never going to grow up? Well, if you mean his physical body, no. Well, how are we supposed to deal with that? We'll figure it out. One day at a time, just like the prayer says. Lord, give me the strength I need to face today. What prayer is that? Prayer for strength, one of my favorites. I need to know something. Okay. Have you ever killed innocent people? Why must you know that? I'm just trying to figure out what to expect. Nobody's completely innocent, are they? So you have, right? Not anymore. I want to hear it. What? The prayer for strength. Oh. Okay. Uh, oh, Lord, you are holy above all others. No, no. I want you to pray with me. Okay. Lord, you are holy above all others, and all the strength we need is in your hands. We do not ask, O oh Lord, that you take this trial away. Instead, we ask that your will be done in our lives. Aaron, hold him down. Oh. Stand up. Hold it up. Oh, it's terrible. You sure this is going to work? No promises. Hello? Hey, did you find him? No. Aaron? Aaron? Uh, just, uh, stay there and call me if he, if he shows up. Mom? Mom? Ah! Honey, what's wrong? What's wrong? <laughs> Is this kid from school? He's out there. What? No, he's coming after me. He's a demon. What? Call for help. Hold on. He's coming after oh, me. Stay right here. No. Tate. 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 Oh my God, Tate, where have you been? Are you okay? You should stay away from me. What are you talking about? Come inside, come on. Where did you go? Well, do you know where he might be or? Okay, listen, I gotta go. All right, yeah. Listen to me. I'm gonna be right there. Don't you let him go anywhere. Oh, I guess five, six years he comes to my bar. 
Evening, officers. Uh, what's going on? Aaron Diaz? Yeah. What were you between three and four this afternoon? Um, why do you ask? He was with me. And where was your car? Oh, uh, well, I had it with me all day. Do you know an Abigail Dasher? No. No, I don't think so. Were you driving in the Bella Vista neighborhood at any time? Montclair Street? <clears throat> no. Sir, Abigail Dasher says a man attacked her this afternoon at her home. A man fitting your description in your car with your license plate. Oh, no, that's, uh, that's got to be a mistake. I think she has the wrong car. So. I don't think so. See, she took a photo of you driving away, and it's indeed your car. I can show you the photo if you'd like. Sir, can you turn and put your hands behind your back? You have the right to remain silent. Hey! Anything... I said he was with me. Do you have any idea what the penalty is for this? I'm guessing it's a doozy. Tell me, you have any kids? It's none of your business. How about you? Yeah. Two. Is there anything you wouldn't do for him? No. What does that have to do with anything? He's just a guy trying to save his son is all. Where is he? Bedroom. I need your blender. Okay. Now! Hey, bud. Hey, Dad. You okay? Where were you? I was thirsty. Look, it's gonna be all right. I didn't do anything. I couldn't. I can't kill again. I want to die. And you have to kill me. Hey, stop. Please. Stop. No, don't say that. Please. Right. Look, listen to me. Listen to me. I found something. What is that? What are you doing? Listen, Tate caught something bad. I'm doing everything I can to make it better. Is that blood? Yeah. Where did you get it? It doesn't matter. What are you going to do with it? It's for Tate. Would you tell me what's going on? I need you to trust me right now. And promise me that no matter what happens, Tate and I are going to have your support. Of course. You know that. Okay. this it stinks I know just do it fast now what I don't know um I guess we just wait. Hey, Vaughn. You want to bet how long it takes this dispatch to send someone to come look for us? How much? A hundred bucks. Who are you? We could use some help.
out of here. No. Away from me. Oh. oh my god! Take What's Take happening? Karen! Karen! Please, you need to get out of here! Karen! Tate! Tate! Come here, Tate! Come back to me! Tate! <laughs> Glad to hear it. I don't know how to thank you. Don't worry about it. Tell them that it's all my fault. Okay, that I that I just forced you into it. No worries. They ain't coming after you. I'll take the blame. I will. All of it. They ain't coming after me either. Why? We got a plan. Just remember, you were with me. What happened? You didn't cut Mike's head off like I told you to. That's what happened. Oh, yeah, I know. I couldn't. I'm sorry. God. Did he? It's all good. We got it all worked out. 